going on guys? This is Mast and welcome back to some more Smite Conquest. Today we're feeding, I think. We're against <laughs> against Erlang, Odin, Kabrakin. I don't know exactly in what order, but like none of these are good matchups. And then I'm guessing it's Erlang jungle and Odin solo, which is absolutely terrifying. So we're trying to go beads for Erlang ganks. And just because in general beads is good. But whether we're against Kabrakin or Odin. Or oh, against Cab, that's better. That's better. But we got to watch out for walls on AMC, man. It's going to be super scary. Are you going to do three things? Oh, he's not going to do three. No, okay, he's going to do three things. So we're playing AMC solo. This is something I played a little bit just kind of for fun lately. And I figured I'd finally take a stab at recording it. But there's been a decent amount of ADC solos in ranked. That's funny. I haven't seen them in casuals as much. But a lot of people have been playing them in ranked. Because obviously solo, it's easier to play damage characters right now. Because you're getting into a deeper late game. Um, and you're getting your build online cab, you're just eating some damage, man. He's eating a ton of damage. Oh my god. But AMC is one of the best brawlers in lane with the downside of being super vulnerable in lane. So we get ridiculous HP5, ridiculous, um, ridiculous, uh, attack speed out of our ones. But the downside is we're not that mobile outside of just the movement speed on our ones. So we're very gankable. But we have crazy amounts of DPS in lane, and we can do some nasty things. Yeah, so it's Odin support. Oh my god, that's so much better, man. Kabrakin's still scary. They still have a ton of kill potential on me, but like at least we're not just automatically caged whenever Odin wants to pop it. That'd be kind of miserable. But because it's been forever since we've done an AMC video, and there's a chance I might have leveled the uh, the abilities differently back in the past when whenever we did the uh, AMC A to Z video. Highly recommend maxing the one on AMC. It's a little bit weird. Your clear is kind of slow, but you get tons of attack speed and a ton of HP five, and as well as a ton of movement speed from uh, from using the highest man. They're so so good if you level them up. Uh, we're just kind of clapping him right now, so don't mind if I do. Yeah, you might want to zoom away, man. But in the very early levels, the one's not that good, and it gives us a decent amount of HP five, but our attack speed and move speed's not that insane yet. But as we get it leveled up, we get 50% attack speed, 30% move speed, and 12 healing per second. Which I think isn't technically HP 5, but I don't know if it matters. Like, I, I think if you somehow hit the HP 5 cap, which might exist, I don't know if it does. I have never tried. I don't even know what it is. But if you tried, I think the healing wouldn't count towards the HP 5. I think it's technically just healing per second. You know, it's basically the same thing, just a different name for it. We're going to keep chucking hives everywhere, though. Once we get ult, we want to start just spamming ult at Kabrakin. It's not as effective against him because it's like a cripple and he doesn't have anything to... Did I, do you get... I think she got it. We're fine. Um, okay, do we want Icky Ball versus Kabrakin? I think we're just going to go it anyways. It's just such a strong early game item, man. But, but yeah, our ult's not really going to, like, cripple him at all, but it's still going to do super damage, and as long as we can retrieve it, we just keep spamming big damage at him. So we're going to look to do that where we can. Let's see, let's grab our little baby camp real quick. Why not? One of the things that's really cool about AMC solo, and uh, I don't know if the other ADC solos are as good at it. AMC is really good at it, but you just get to zoom around and do all the camps, basically. As long as you're not worried about ganks, it's so easy to control every single camp, at least in most lands. Okay, he might actually be scary now. I'm not totally sure. We'll try not to get murdered by his three. Oh, he's going for it, huh? I think we actually die here. I actually fucked up, man. Oh! Not even close, baby. Do you have blink? He has blink. Uh, this might be a good back. <laughs> this is like a, a necessary back. Oh my god, man. I underestimated his damage. Holy shit. 140? Okay, he got a ton off of autos. And out of his gem. My god, man. Yeah. This was the big thing, though. I didn't think his 1-2 uh, his would hit so hard. They really did. They did a lot of work. I think his one hit like as hard as his ult for some reason. You trying to bully me? He is already tanky boy, right? No. I just do potato damage because we don't have Icky Ball done. That makes sense. That makes sense. Damn, we missed a ton of farm. Can you stop? Damn, it's too bad our jungle's not here. <laughs> He's so out of position. <laughs> but it's fine. It's fine. Are they? That's kind of BM. All right, we got to give all money, basically. I think we grab blue, grab Waven back. If we can. Yeah, we're on such a shit power spike right now, man. Because I just have T2 of it here, and it absolutely blows. I'm pretty sure it gives us 10 power. It gives us 10 power, 20% attack speed. It's so garbage. Because we just don't really have enough damage yet. 
We don't have enough power to do anything. Especially since we're leveling our one, so we don't have like base damage on abilities, so we're all auto damage, and then we don't have any auto damage. <laughs> Once we get to give all the metal change really hard, we should actually start slapping him a lot since he's going a greedy build. Let's see, I think we're gonna stick around one more wave, because I don't think he can fight at this health. It looks like he wants to, but oh no, he's is he doing blue? I don't know. Kind of feel like we're getting ganked though. We're dipping, I don't care about this thing. Don't you do it, Cabrankin. All right, we get this done. Yeah, we should start slapping a bit. I don't know how we're gonna build this. I don't know if I wanna go crit on AMC. Uh, the thing about playing any ADC in solo is it's more important to get pen online early for almost any matchup. This guy's going to greedy Warlocks, but even after Warlocks, he should still be going Breastplate or something, I'm assuming. So we probably wanna be working straight into a bunch of bows, going like Atalanta, Silver Branch, uh, stuff like that, getting instant pen. Oh my god, this is so much better, man. We hit so much harder. Alright, it's actually popped down wards. Could be good, could be good. This has been a slow game so far. It makes sense for us, you know? But, like, in general, it's only 2 to 1. I feel like all my games lately have been just crazy. Oh, yeah. I don't know why that's silent. You're welcome, boys. Is there a in there? I hope there's not. I called missing, so obviously I did everything, right? Worry, Why would I rotate? Sure you helped. Nice job. Big slow. Big cripple. Get fucked. <laughs> nice, we got some big jukes on him too. Uh, we might get a zoom at him with Hive? Oh, that's huge. Come here. Come to Papa. Oh, what a pull! Let's go! Oh my god, Sylve, you nut. They got him. They got him. I must go all out. Let's hope that we don't get murdered by Cabrack. And he's got Warlocks done, but we're getting pretty big health off of our one right now. Okay, good, good. I fucked up and killed myself. Okay. <laughs> if I pass straight out, we were good. Okay. I think he's leveling his three. Is he? He has to be, right? I'm pretty sure he's leveling his three. That would make sense. We have a, we're one of the few characters in the game. I'm trying to think, there's actually like almost nobody, right? Yeah, we're one of the few characters in the game where we have literally no way to cancel his three, which is really bad for us. So, so he gets to actually level it, which is so rare, man. Although I can't tell for sure if he is or not. It's hitting really hard, but it might, it might just be because it scales so hard. I honestly think it'd be smart of him to straight up level the three. It has a really low cooldown and he can hit me with it so easily. Like he can use the others for CC and then just clap me. Okay, if she actually ganks him here, if he's on blue. Oh, he's not. Okay, he already did it, I guess. Rip. Don't worry, I'm coming, I'm coming. Yeah, we fuck him up, we fuck him up. Are you kidding me, man? Oh my, we're dead. That feels bad. Yeah, I didn't expect Odin support ganking us from, like, our speed bump. <laughs> what was that angle that he came from? <laughs> I'm actually so confused. Oh, that was a big Silvol. Get him. Get him. Oh, he doesn't have crack and rip. Oh, my God. Be dead, man. You should probably stop queuing with that guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, dude. Damn, that sucks. I feel like Poseidon should have been able to clean that up. Poor Silv, man. He actually played it really well. And it just didn't matter. So I don't know if we go Aegis or Phantom this game. They have Cabracken Wall, which I was already tempted to go Phantom just, just like maybe for Cabracken Wall, depending on matchups. Uh, which so far I honestly feel like would have been worth. I think his wall is scarier than his CC right now. But yeah, like they have enough stuff. We actually might just want to straight up go Phantom here. That's funny, man. We're getting so destroyed by counter matchups. <laughs> the Odin Cabracken is so disgusting into us. And of course, we're already getting support ganked nine minutes in. It's definitely smart on his part, but oh my god, it's so annoying. Yeah, in ranked, obviously, it's different. We don't pick AMC into this. But in casuals, we can't really know. And so sometimes we just get screwed when we pick the risky gods like this. But at least our autos are starting to slap, man. They're doing some work right now. What's up, Keb? He's a level up. He's got, uh, he's working on Tyrannical. Yeah, we don't do a ton to him. We do some to him. If we do sustained trades, we can easily fight. 
But it's kind of hard to take sustained trades. He burst us really hard. Keb? Keb? Okay. I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> what, are you, what are you doing, man? He's just going on a trip. Stop. Yeah, we do so little to him right now, man. We really need uh, our Atalantis done. I guess we're just dead. Yeah, we're literally just dead. We need defense. Oh my god. It's fine. Late game, I think, we'll be okay. But right now, it's disgusting how hard he gets because he's on his power spike. That's crazy, man. How do I, like, how do I play against this? He gets to tremor me so easily, and then the rest of his abilities just kill me. Yeah, all of his abilities are doing over 200 right now. And, like, with our health bar, that's not okay. I could build defense, but I feel like that's troll. It's fine. We'll power through. I think we'll manage. Your left tower is under attack. I can try and play like a total bitch. Maybe we'll do that. Maybe we'll just play like a total bitch. Because <laughs> I keep trying to figure out how I can possibly like trade with him. And I think the answer is just we can't. At least not at this point. If we were more ahead, maybe? Even then, I don't know, man. I'm also trying to run away from his ult and stuff. And my only chance is to turn. But at this point, we definitely just can't turn. We definitely just need more more damage right now to be able to fight him. I do think going Devos might have been big though. If we got like that that bonus sustain, it might have been really huge. Do I get to be greedy? I want to clap Raijin. He knows, doesn't he? Uh, does he not know? Oh my god, he actually got him. Let's go. Easy Raijin beads, baby. Give me this tower. Give me this tower. Damn, the big value AMC ganks. Not something you see much of. AMC's terrible at ganking, man. You gotta chuck a hive and then hope you can fight in the hive. It's so awkward. Alright, don't let her steal it. Don't let her steal it. We're good. How are we? We're not good. How did she literally like autoed it? How did she? Dude, how did she get to auto it, man? That kind of sucks. I guess he like didn't save Tidal Wave or whatever. Or maybe he just like secured a little bit off and, and gave her kind of free gold. I don't know. Unfortunate, man. I've got a Sylph, so I'm actually going to chase here. Nice. And we hit him from the back. <laughs> He's body blocked in by his own ult. <laughs> oh, you jumped in on the wrong fight, bud. Okay, maybe not. You have big cage. Break all the walls. Nice. We're actually uh, we're actually evening things up. Lane has gone absolutely terrible. But whenever we rotate out of lane and we don't have to deal with Kabrakan soloing us, we actually clap. All right. How much is Silver Branch, man? Twenty two hundred. I think we just get one more wave. One thing that's too bad is I think we have a really good matchup into Erling. I think we can farm Erling if he went for ganks, but he really hasn't. The only time we really had to deal with a gank was uh, when we got ganked by Odin, right? I think? I don't know. Let's see, do we go Aegis? Do we go... Yeah, I actually, I actually think we straight up go Phantom. There's definitely a lot of damage we can Aegis too. Like Raijin, Raijin Cab Burst would be huge to have Aegis for. But also not getting walled by Odin or, or uh, Cab would be pretty nice. This is kind of refreshing, man. I hope this game stays good and we don't get like an early F6 or anything. I don't know why we would. We're only like 2k up. But it's kind of nice having a video where like we play a greedy pick. We get punished for the greedy pick, but we still play it well enough. At least so far. Maybe I'm speaking too soon. But we play it well enough that, like, we still get stuff done, you know? Okay. We just get punished in the bad matchup. Alright, place ward. I'm scared. Yeah, we're gonna try and take notes from the getting clapped so far and try to not get clapped. How about that? Cabra Stop taking all my... Dude, uh, those are my babies. He's just killing all my babies. It's kind of fucked up, man. I guess you get calling missing left for me because I'm not I'm not thinking enough to do it. Big calls, big calls. 
It is appreciated. Oh, that's cute. Watch this, boys. No vision. Oh, God. <laughs> it's not what I thought was going to happen. Oh, my God. Somebody else kill Odin. Oh, that went under him. That's unfortunate. Okay, nice. We got out of that. That's huge. Please, please play three. Nice. Melted. Big bees, big bees. Dead Erlang. Raijin, where are you going, man? Melt him. Let's go, boys. We're clapping. I'm not going to lie. I think that fight was mostly luck. We were so close to getting cab ulted, and I think that was straight up the difference in the fight. Maybe the boys would have farmed anyways, but at least as far as us getting anything done, I think we're just dead if we get cab ulted. <laughs> Which is so AIDS, man. It's like, all right, Odin cage. We phantom out of the Odin cage. What is it? 150? Yeah, 150 second cooldown. And then, you know, cab ult just follows it. It's kind of ridiculous, dude. We actually probably could have done fire if we tried. Because we have a ton of burn. Poseidon has pretty good damage, and we have double ADC. Okay, I'm not going to lie. This is a little greedy. If I see Kabrak and I should run. That's fine. We're running anyways. All right, we probably want to go Xy next because we want to make sure that we're burning through. I don't know. He's not super tanky. How tanky is Odin? Erlang's going a little defense. Odin's not that tanky. Um, we have 20% pen. Maybe that's fine. Maybe we go crit. Get like a wind demon or something. I think like wind demon should give us 10% pen pretty consistently as well because we auto so much. And then I think if we follow wind demon with like Deathbringer, I think this will actually be a really solid build. We won't get a ton of silver branch value, but that should be okay. Because part of why we're building it just for pen. Yeah, it just kind of feels like Xy I don't think does all that much right now. Maybe maybe eventually it'll change. I'm surprised they're not tanky right now. Oh, baby. Get him. Oh my god, we're slapping. We did get a Wind Demon crit, but this man does zoom. Damn, unfortunate, man. That sucks. I don't think we could have possibly killed him there. I didn't even pick up my my ult either. <laughs> Do we just not get to kill him? Oh my god, man. It's too hard. Kavrakin zooms too hard. Odin's practically unkillable. It's ridiculous, dude. I think this is up, right? It's actually funny. Our Sylvie's been playing like a nut, man. He's also got Diamond Sylv. Um, <laughs> but our Sylv plays a ton of Odin. So it's actually, I don't know, it's a little bit ironic. I play with this guy a decent amount. It's kind of ironic that we're going into an Odin as somebody that plays a shitload of Odin. Wait, uh, do I get a clap Raijin? Probably he jumps wall. Yeah, never mind. I really want to be greedy and chase. But yeah, I don't know where he went. Whoops. I'm actually going to beads just because I think Cab blinks for me. I actually think that might have been a nutty beads. <laughs> it looked really weird because we were so far and seemingly so fine. But we were, I'm honestly pretty sure we were close to getting blink ulted by Cab there. And we're not beadsing that much anyways. Yeah, fuck man. That was so greedy on my part though. I shouldn't have been up there. It was so stupid to be trying to chase Raijin at all. Did they get my blue? At 20 minute, what am I going to do? What am I going to do, sir? Can't tell me. Oh my god, I'm already down one mana. Alright, they got Scorp again because they're obsessed. Bop. We got to be really careful about how we rotate in here. Especially since we don't have beads for Erlang. Yeah, on her, be my bodyguard. Be my little body bitch. <laughs> Not your play, man. <laughs> oh, whoops. Trolling a little bit. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Trying to body block, though. Nice. Oh, no. How? What? Did he die to dog? It is a... I guess... I mean, holy shit. We were talking just the other day about if hypothetically the voice packs or the announcer packs evolved. 
And then Punk Duck, when we're talking about Erlang Dog, it says it's a dog eat dog world. Now he's a little bit off. Honor is not a dog, but holy shit, man, the immersion is on point. Oh, what the? You dick. You think I don't just eat this and frag? Well, he took my hive, so we actually might not now. Okay, we landed enough. I missed a bit, but we landed enough. Oh, shit. Okay, okay. I don't have beads, but okay. Oh, good try, good try. I respect it. Does it get me killed? Okay, not quite. Good. <laughs> Sil was so greedy right there, man. <laughs> I just wanted to follow up with him. Oh, God. Yeah, let's not get caught. Let's not get caught. Can I just live my life, man? Can I just do my B things? Hold up. Big ward. Might be trash ward. I don't know. I want to lurk because I think they might just get free FG if we don't. Oh, they're going for it. What? What? Huh? Dude, he's... Oh my god, that's insane! He's through the wall, so we can't auto him. That's so AIDS. Uh, I, did my ult hit Odin? I got really confused. <laughs> I thought I thought I ulted... I gotta look back at that entire engagement, man. I'm so lost. I thought I... Was it server lag? I think it's just her cat lagging. But, uh... Yeah, I thought we ulted Erlang, and then, like, I just kind of left click on Erlang's face, and then Erlang took zero damage. But I'm pretty sure what happens is I think my ult hit Odin, and I was tripping. I think a bunch of my autos got absorbed by fatty Odin wall hitboxes, and we just got screwed. Oh, okay. I don't even know what he did, but good job. Oh, you gamer! He has Aegis. Is it enough? Is it enough? No. It's not enough. Easy. So easy. Give me this. Give me OP item. <laughs> yeah, and done while lagging. Well played. Well played. Yeah, I don't know if this is a Silver Branch game, though. This might have just been a better game to go Xy. I guess we do get Wind Demon value, but even when we have, like, Hive plus Wind Demon, I think we get, like... What? Like... Oh, we also... Yeah, 21. 21. Silver range stacks, not too many. I feel like it should be more, right? Am I missing something? No, I guess that's right. Because it does represent it a little bit weird. The uh, the way the passive is indicated, it's like it, it could basically the passive kind of represents like two power instead of one power, which is a little bit clunky. I don't know why they don't just like double the stacks and then make it one power, so it translates a little bit better. Do we just do fire? Like, I can just kind of melt it, I think. I don't know if I'm throwing. Raijin's not here. I don't, is it even worth ulting Cabman? Like, he's dead, but I think I auto him about as hard as I ult him. You know? Oh, we get this. We get this. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> All right. We have Phantom up. Odin shouldn't be scary. How many other commands are there? Attack. Atta how many others? Okay, I, the others are going to be trolling. I was going to say attack the Gold Fury. <laughs> oh my god, man. What? Raijin, stop it, man. I'm not going to lie. I ate way more damage there than I thought I would. But still, stop. Oh my, dude, Odin. Rest in peace, man. Oh my god, the boys. Nice, big phantom. Bye. <laughs> oh my god, this was the build, man. Part of it was them goofing. They uh, they didn't build nearly tanky enough. Kabrakken did not respect our late game damage at all. And Odin kind of built like he was solo lane versus just a generic solo laner. So we got to absolutely melt and not build as much pen as we needed. And uh, that led to 700 crit autos with full attack speed. Kind of insane. That was a good game, man. That was actually really cool. I definitely misplayed a bit in the early game, but we also just had a really bad matchup and Kabrakken played it well and actually punished me. 
And then we got to move on from that and do <laughs> and do this <laughs> and do an insane amount of work. That's awesome. But thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you all enjoyed the video and I'll see you all in the next one. I've been seeking for the glory. Say, say, say my name. And I've been trying to wrap my own story in the search for fame. I'm sitting here in this empty room. Walls keep tumbling down.